Yep. One. There we go. There we go. Good. Good. Yep. Sneaking in from the back. That's where I come from. Don't say it goes, Jim. You always sneak through the back. Oh, wide. I like it. Oh, yeah. Nice. Nice one. Come on. That's it. Yep. Yep. Big, big delts. Come on. I mean, that looks good and all, but what about your wrists? And your shoulders and your four elbows. Oh, I know. So that's going to injure you right there, guys. Please don't do this exercise. We're trying to get um, views. We're trying to sell our programs. These exercises that we're doing are made up on the fly. Um, anything else we can add to it? Sheesh. What's the point of her doing that weight? with you spotting and stuff. What's the point of it? Well, it looks good on camera. <laughs> um, no. When you hold a weight, your central nervous system gets used to holding that weight. Hold it, what weight? Any weight? Any weight that you're not used to holding. <laughs> your body has to feel it to become acclimated to it. Okay? So, and it looks really good on camera. Right. So, yeah, I do, I'm so glad you said that because he's going to be the nice one relative to me. Because you guys are such babies when it comes to things like this or doing odd things. Like, it doesn't hurt the wrist. The wrist is fine. Uh, oh, yeah. Baby mama just did this. Yes, and she's never done it before. And it's like, you guys you guys instantly look at something and go, oh, that, that hurts you. And you know what? It probably does. But it's you that it's hurting because you already mentally think that way. You're the kind of person that drives defensively and, and, and wears the mask by yourself in bed at night. So it's like... Did you know sorry. I'm psychic? Did you know that? I didn't I'm know I'm psychic. That. Because if if you don't think you can do something, I know you can. Yeah. Boom. Let's go. You're okay. Good. Go. Ah. For your partners, you can ah. keep the bar forward just by rotating it forward. Nice. nice. That's good weight. Come on. So no help. Oh. Oh. Nice. Oh. Nice. Yep. Nice. One, Go. two, head, up. So it's just a rotation bar for if somebody. Yeah. He can, but I wanted him to focus because it's 275 on the now. And it's on this. And it's probably, on this. They probably haven't seen that. You guys don't even. Yeah, so right now, first off, it's not going up, yeah. it's going out. So instead of us pressing like this, we're pressing like this. So it's a bit of a length, and then we got the bench back. So it's here and here, a couple different things going on. And don't don't worry, guys. None of you are offended by this video that are actually men still. <sighs> Too much? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> Mona's like, you Americans are so weak. Where are the men? <laughs> we do it. We do it good this time. Yes. So Just do it right, okay? <laughs> Get kind of that angle of the Smith going forward, bench is going back. Ten is easy. Ten is easy. Pressing angle. This is your exercise. Yeah, you got this. Yeah. That's it. Delts to the ears. Big delts right to the ears. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm on the bench. You're good. Just push. Just push. Good, Mike. Come on. Yeah. I always like your cues, Doug. Uh, pull your body through space. Uh, pull to the contraction. What is that one? Uh, delts to yeah, the ears. Delts to ears. You have to, when you're training chest, I always tell my clients, I say, for, or when you're training shoulders, excuse me. When you're training shoulders, I always say, forget everything I ever taught you about training chest and back. Because the shoulders have to move if you're using them by themselves. And that's why I always say, 
delts to the ears so that you really finish with that front delt. Just another way to think about how to get everything out of what you're trying to do. It's a big boy, I'd listen. Here we go. Yeah. That's my guy. Go. There we go. Go. Oh. Here we go. Ah. Drop it down. Oh. On the bottom. Thank you, sir. Captain, my captain. Oh. Ooh -wee. That fucking, those last two were That was religious. So you feel it. Triceps, <laughs> upper chest. Everything. My glutes are pumped. Your glutes are blocked. No, just look at that. <laughs> look at the blood flow. So if you watch front this delt. video, you'll see that the front <sighs> delt actually separated. Go back to the video, guys. Watch again. You'll see the front delt separate oh. to where it is the one, the major muscle working. Um, for all of you uh, beginners that go, well, I just want to isolate the front delt and not everything else. Good. Go do that. Good luck. I'm going to show you something you'll <laughs> never in your entire life have. What that is called is thickness. You're gonna have an Instagram body where you are two-dimensional. Just Very, like your page. Just like the page. <laughs> Three baddies, bottoms up. That's good. What a press. How impressive. Nice. Good. You know what time it is. Come on now. Work time, son. Yep. Come on. There's four. Yep. Easy money. Oh, yeah. Get me all day. Get it. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm here. You got it. You got it. You got it. I'm not going first again. When you see somebody doing laterals wrong, you can instantly kind of... Absolutely. Yeah. Instantly. What gives it away? It's a movement of the trap. Yeah. This. That'll tell you right away. Here's the thing about shoulders, right? Shoulders are the, the laziest muscle on the body. They want to help everybody with everything and do nothing on their own. That's, that's just the way shoulders work. And that's how they're designed. They are stability, stability muscles, you know, at its purity. So... So we have to figure out how to isolate the shoulders, which they don't want to do. It's not a natural thing. That's why the brain plays a big part. But look at Mike here. Look at Mike. No trap movement really until the very end as the delt is pushing into the trap. So you can tell he's not lifting with his back. He's lifting with his delt, pushing the, the weight away from him to the side. That's how you isolate it. Trap move, Jeff. None. Yes. Not at all. Nice, Mike. Did it. Mike. They get you. They get you. Oh. <laughs> it didn't quit it. Watch. No trap shrug at all. It's not the trap going up. Little bit of swing. Ooh. Ooh. Swing's probably not the best for it. Ooh. Ooh. Let's go, Doug. Uh, five. Come on. One, two, let's go. Three, four. Come on. Uh, let's go, big Doug. Uh, yeah. Uh. Go ahead. Last one. Last chance. We're gonna earn that breakfast tomorrow. Come on. Yeah. He's gonna earn that crust ball of hair. Yeah. Early, but I also said early in the sense of so probably 55, 60, even though you're 80. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. It's it's like because what they're gonna do is they're gonna go, he's 80, he fucking looks great for 80. No, no, he looks good for 45. And so 
we were just talking about as kids, all you think about is muscle. Because right. you don't have to worry about the joints. Joints, because you don't feel nothing yeah. at that time. But I, I was lucky enough, and we were both lucky enough to go, there's bone density, connective tissue, muscle will come and go. Yeah. Momo, hold on, hold on. Jump go, back go, in. Go ahead. You go sure? Ahead. Go ahead. Okay. I just, it just, this gym is a plethora of knowledge yes. if you ask the right people. Yes. And so I'm going to go to him a hundred times more than your guys' favorite current bodybuilder or fitness guy that's 25. I don't give a sh about what he does. I care about what Robbie Robinson has done. I care about what Arnold has done, what these guys have done. 60 years of lifting. Robbie says, Robbie says he's just managing the decline. Yeah, it's, it's basically managing the decline, but not giving up. Right, not giving up. Oh my gosh, you good? Oh my god. Oh, I love that. My girl saw him the other day and it was like, oh. He's a German Husky German Shepherd. He is a mix. Yeah, he's three years old. And my daughter got a airplane. Yeah, yeah, I love that. You got that Husky coat. I get in bed and find someone. It's just not the other. So, rescue. Thanks for telling me. Thanks for introducing me. Appreciate that. Pleasure, pleasure. Man, this gym is the best. It's the best. Oh, yeah, she smells our kids. And of course, you like this too. The better half. The better half. Much better.